GNN News at 8, a bus plowed into a police car which has pulled over a Jeep Grand Cherokee for speeding 56 miles per hour in a 40 mile per hour limit zone. The rips off the fence. I second that foul call to Tailsland Valley Commuter Transit Authority for disregarding police stops and barricades that are destructible. I call ban violation on the bus driver. On my way home, I saw the bus driver crash into a police car and a metal fence hitting 11 people as they went down the steps to the beach. I second that foul call to TVCTA. From now on, Rami and Joey Starship. The passengers on to bus 1072 second the foul call to the company and call ban violation to the bus driver. This is Joyce Ranga reporting. Good evening again. Two bus crashes in one week by TVCTA. Bus 1151 hit a car sped quickly, drifted and crashes into a car wash on Juanita Marquez Boulevard this week tonight. Am I kidding? Am I really kidding? Another bus accident from TVCT this week. That's impossible. I hope TVCT shuts down transit bus services. From now on, I hope this bus service gets shut down automatically from Tailsland Valley Commuter Transit Authority sooner or later. If my son does it, I hope she is honest. I agree with my mommy. This bus service gets shut down automatically by the TVCTA. I hope we should take a taxi, DRF, or walk to our destination instead of that stupid bus. I'm live at the scene of the accident at the slipslide car wash in Ryder, South Carolina. 14 people were injured. Here's the driver of bus 1151, Rydet Smith. On my way to the next bus stop, a car popped out of nowhere and I hit it, losing control, drifting and ran into the car wash around the corner. I was shocked as the bus speeds up. In the end. Officer Amethyst Martinez of Ryder Police is on the scene as well. The following five-second song concludes the news. We will continue with this story as it develops.